Hey, we're here on the sunny island of Kauai in Hawaii, where we're checking out Tesla's large scale solar power generation and storage facility. It's the largest facility of its kind that can gather power from the sun during the day when it's the sunniest out and then deploy it at night when it's needed most. Yeah, this is a really exciting project. Um, this is one of the first projects where we're integrating storage directly with solar on the same site. So here we have um, almost 13 megawatts of solar panels. Uh, that are able to connect directly in with about 52 megawatt hours of Tesla battery packs. So during the day when the sun is out, the solar panels feed their energy into the batteries and store it. And even if clouds come over and you know, drop the output occasionally, you know, the batteries are able to buffer that and then deliver the electricity back to the utility and to the customers. So in this way, we can have you know, very robust, reliable solar electricity delivered back to the customers almost 24 hours a day. You know, we have a, a whole host of different projects that are uh, underway or in the pipeline. And uh, you know, there, there's going to be an increasing ramp up of, of things like this happening. Um, you know, all, as I said, all around the world, not just in island locations, but you know, the ability to buffer and store renewable energy is a fundamental uh, requirement. You know, whether it's even wind or, or solar, um, you can't get to high percentages, which all the countries and cities around the world want to do unless you have a way to store it and make it very reliable.